Hi there, my name's Graham Armfield from Caulfields Consulting and this is the first in a series of videos I've created about Dragon Naturally Speaking. Dragon Naturally Speaking is voice recognition software marketed by a company called Nuance. My interest in it stems from the fact that many people with motor impairments use voice recognition software like Dragon to help them control their computers and laptops, including browsing the web and creating and editing documents. And when testing websites for accessibility, I usually include some testing with Dragon to see how easy it is for people with motor impairments to use the website. When you first get Dragon, and I've got version 12 here, it all comes in this box. The two key bits inside the box are this CD with the application on it and a useful headset with which you can communicate with Dragon. Because of the sensitivity of voice recognition software, it's much better to use a headset with Dragon, naturally speaking, than a desktop microphone or the microphone in your laptop. Now, when you first install Dragon, naturally speaking, it will recognise successfully most of what you're saying, but it's much better to spend an hour or so training Dragon to better recognise your voice. To do this, you are prompted to read some passages of text that Dragon provides. Whilst you are doing this, Dragon is tuning itself to your voice. Dragon stores all the information about your voice in a profile and if you have more than one person who needs to use it, it's possible to create multiple profiles on one machine, but each person will need to go through the training process. The training process with Dragon actually never stops because every time you use it, you can have Dragon update your profile to further improve its recognition of your voice and vocabulary. You can also have Dragon, naturally speaking, review documents and emails so that it recognises technical terms, jargon and figures of speech that you use. This series of videos introduce a number of the features of Dragon, naturally speaking, from starting and switching between applications, creating and revising documents, through to browsing the web, including interacting with forms, links and other elements found on web pages. I hope you find these videos useful. If you have any questions about the subjects covered in the videos or things you feel I haven't covered, please let me know and I'll do what I can to answer them.